friends out there, I'm here to talk to you about the purpose of the Glorious Family Ministry. You know, uh, Miles Moron said, when purpose is not known, abuse is inevitable. And we don't want anyone abusing the awesome privilege that God has given to us. And that's the reason why I'm taking out this time to talk to you about the purpose of the Glorious Fountain Ministry. Number one, I want you to understand that we are here to create an awareness of the presence of God. That is one thing that we are out to do. Wherever we step into, we look forward to see the glory of God walk in with us. And you know, whenever praises rises up to God, they say the glory comes down. And you know, the glory is nothing but the presence of God. God dressed up himself in glory. He's covered in glory. And when we give him the praise that is due unto his name, his glory is made manifest. And so whenever we show up anywhere, whether it is in our own you know, facility or somewhere, anywhere in the world, whenever we show up, we seek to have God glorified. We seek to make the presence of God known. And that is our number one motive of stepping out or doing what God has called us to do. We are first and foremost worshippers and we want to all make all that worship in, in spirit and in truth. So it becomes very important that if you're going to bring people into the presence of God, if you're going to make them have a fortress of the glory of God, then you must have an understanding of what that glory is all about. And that's why the scripture there says, and the earth shall be filled with his knowledge and glory. So before there is the feeling of glory, there is the feeling of knowledge. So the earth shall be filled with his knowledge and glory of the water that covers the sea. three points I want to share with you is that we are here to cause a paradigm shift in the mind of people you know we really want to bring about a shift in the way people think about you know worship you know many people think that worship had to do with attending church or having some titles or positions but you know it is far from having a title or position worship is in spirit and in truth and in the process of doing what we're doing we're trusting God to help us cut a paradigm shift in the local church. We believe in God that there's going to be a revolution. Uh, you don't start a revolution by getting AK-47. Uh, somebody who is armed with knowledge is much more dangerous than somebody with AK-47. Uh, most of the revolution we've had uh, worldwide, like you're having right now the Arab, Arab Spring uh, Revolution, and a number of revolutions before that happened by virtue of understanding. And we are trusting God that the, the grip of tradition, uh, religion in our society will be broken, uh, in our church will be broken, and people will be liberated from religiosity into spirituality, where the glory of God will become a very strong manifestation in our experiences, not just because we gather in a place, but because we carry it along wherever we go. We talk it, we leave it, we are it. We are not just trying to uh, replicate it, we have to come it. And you know, that's when uh, it is in us and we are in him. And we trust in God, it is going to flow into our churches, it is going to come upon families, revolutionize the way worship is done in most of our traditional setting 
in God's name with the glory God. And I bet you, you're about to see something awesome. Put your hand in your pocket. Four point I have to share with you is that we are here to help the local church. You know, sometimes when you start up something like this, somebody may think that you are here to steal somebody's church members. Uh, but you know, you go back to the scripture, there was nothing like stealing it. anybody's church members. It, it was one church, it is, was one Lord and one baptism, one faith. And that's what we believe in Glorious Family Ministries. Though we all belong to various churches, like different denominations, and we are committed members of those churches, in fact, we just can't be anything else. One of the reasons why we have to be committed to the various churches that like other, like the mainstream churches and all that, is simply because we cannot be outside those denominations to be able to influence and cause the desire change. We just have to be inside. And so, Glorious Fountain is a strong conduit for the manifestation of the glory of God in our local churches. The, the presence of God will be made manifest. So, we, we, we focus on making the local church succeed. Now, wherever you are listening to the sound of my voice, hearing me or seeing me right now, take note of this. We are out to help the local church. We are here to make the local church succeed. Uh, we, we want those who are in the choir to go back to their choir and cause an unusual lift. Now something that will be obvious manifestation of the presence of God. If somebody is working in a protocol in their own churches, their protocol should be fine. I mean, it should be wonderful. If you're working in a media crew, their own churches, the media crew should be wonderful. And so, you, you see, kind of like, Glorious Fountain is more of a serious uh, catalyst for change, but then a, a serious uh, point where the church have her members equipped to do the job we are called to do to the glory of God for the kingdom of God. Fountain ministry in every local church. Now that's a, a tall dream, uh, you may say, but I know it's very possible. We don't have to have them uh, always being in the city of refuge, uh, you know, in Warri Delta State. But you know, one way or the other, they could have been influenced by what we're doing, and then they run with it. And we believe in God that it won't be long that we will have at least five persons who are serious. GFI, call them GFI, who are running with the knowledge of the glory of God and also bringing sin to wherever they find themselves. My name is Mrs. Patricia Atake. I attend the Catholic Church, Word of Life Bible Church, Worry, Living Faith Church, Worry, Anglican Church, Christ Embassy, Beulah International, From Redeemed Christian Church of God, Rainbow Christian Assembly, Anchor of Hope Ministry, Pentecostal African Church, Christ Missionaries Crusaders Church, Gospel Church of Christ, I'm from Fekka Baptist Church. We are members of the Glorious Fountain Ministry.